just that you know what is the best for us and that you have someone special in mind for us. Please guide us to the right partner and help us recognize them when we come into their life. Feel our patience and peace as we wait for your perfect timing. We pray for love that is kind, honest, and true. In Jesus' name, Amen. Good morning. Happy New Day. Happy Saturday, March 2nd, 2024. This is Love Walk, the key you open heaven, a guide to fellowship with God. In our custom, let's say, Hallelujah. 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 Hallelujah in an evil language. Hallelujah song we never say so I'm out in Jesus' name. Amen. The topic before this morning is your right hand man. Your right hand man. I mean we fashion and be find the book of Exodus 17, verse 12. I read. But Moses' hand were heavy, and they took a stone and put it under him, and he sat there on. And Aaron and her stay up his hand, the one on the one side, and the other on the other side. And his hand were steady on to the going down of the sun. But Moses' hand were heavy, and they took his stone and put it under him, and he sat there on. And Aaron and all stay up his hand, the one on the other side, and the other one on the other side, and his right hand were steady on the going down of the sun. For everyone will become great, there is always at least one person who provide to be or is or a right hand man. For example, in Exodus 4 verse 10 to 16. When Moses told God that he could not go to Egypt because he could not speak well, God appointed Aaron to assist him. In Exodus 17, verse 8 to 13, when the Amalekites came to attack Israel, Moses went to the mountain top with Aaron and Hor and taught Joshua to lead the army in the valley below. Moses lifted up his right hand, and Israel prevailed. But when his hand got tied, Aaron and her gave him a rod to sit on and held up his hand. In the meantime, Joshua was in the valley below, fighting all these people were right hand men to Moses. We find another example in Genesis 24. Abraham called his lead servant and asked him to get a wife. For his song among his Abraham people, that less servant was Abraham's right hand, man in this case. I should however also note that the term is genderless, as a woman can also be a right man to another woman. The right hand man is someone who is close enough to his or her leader to know what they later need at every moment and be proactive. In providing it, you should also identify your right hand man. If you haven't, your right hand man can see what you cannot see yourself or might have a way of presenting the matter that will effectively pass on your intended message. He or she can be the lifter of your hand, the one who will help you when your hand grows weary. Such a person is the one who can provide you with something to sit upon when you are tired. Someone who can make you comfortable even at his or her own discomfort. Like Joshua, he or she is the one who can fight your battle even when you are not there. Your big right hand man is the one who despite your closeness will never take you for granted because of familiarity. Your right hand man is one who see your weakness and not use them against you or go around telling others about them. 
he or she will rather cover them as Aaron and her did for Moses. The right hand man is the one to whom you can entrust in and be sure that they will do as you want it to be done. Note that God will have you serve as a right hand man to someone as well. But then, I want us to read the book of Exodus 4, verse 10 to 16, and our Bible in one year, the Tyronomy 30, verse 32, Hawaii in 10, in Christ alone, in Christ alone. Our action point for today, bring that God should connect you to the right hand man. He has been fair for you, and also thank him specially for adding another year to my year today. Pray that God should connect you to the right hand man. He has prepared for you and also thank him specially for adding another year to my year today. And I pray my Heavenly Father will bless you and will guide you through the journey of life in Jesus name. Have a nice day and have a nice weekend. And bye for now. God bless you. Ready? Don't forget, subscribe to the channel, click on the like button, share with your friends and family. And goodness of God, we never live a life. And bye for now. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Hallelujah.